four fundamental operations in mathematics are multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. Example we have here 2 times 3, 4 divided by 2, 1 plus 8, 7 minus 5. So let's answer 6, 2, 9, and 2. We have learned that the usual way of solving uh, operations like multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction are performed from left to right. Just like here, 2 times 3 from left to right, that is 6. 4 divided by 2, that is 2. 1 plus 8, that is 9. 7 minus 5, 2. We have performed these operations, or we have answered, from left to right. We have performed the operations from left to right. That is the usual way. Now, the question is, what if, if we are going to perform two or more operations in one equation? What are we going to do? Okay, example here. 2 plus 5 times 4. So, here in this example, we can see two operations. If an equation involves more than one operation, the order of operations should be applied. Okay? And that is the MDAS rule. MDAS stands for M, multiplication, D, division, A, addition, S, for subtraction. In the MDAS rule, you have to perform first the multiplication or division. Remember? Multiplication and division first. Solve that first. As they appear from left to right. Here, in the example of 2 plus 5 times 4, we cannot add 2 plus 5, 2 and 5. Because we have here a multiplication sign. Okay? We have to follow this rule. We have to uh, perform first multiplication and uh, or division. So we have 5 times 4, perform this first. 5 times 4, that is 20. Now, what was left? We have 2 plus 20. That's the time that we are going to add from left to right. 2 plus 20, that is 22. Another example. Don't worry because I will give you a lot of examples for you to fully understand our topic for today's video. So we have here 3 plus 6 times 2. So can we perform 3 plus 6? No, we can't because we have here a multiplication symbol, a multiplication sign. So that means 2 operations. So if there are 2 or more operations, we are going to follow the order of operations. And that is the time that the MDAS rule will be applied. Let us solve. Perform first multiplication and division. 6 times 2, 12. So if we are done uh, solving multiplication and division, that's the time we are going to do addition and subtraction. Perform the operations from left to right. So we have here 3 plus 12, 15. For examples, 23 minus 6 divided by 2 equals n. n is the missing number. 6 divided by 2, that is 3. Now, if we have done uh, solving multiplication and division in the given equation, we are going to perform the addition and subtraction. So, what was left? We have 23 minus 3, that is 20. So, n is equal to 20. More examples, we have 2 times 4 plus 8 divided by 4 equals n. So we have here n is equal to, remember, multiplication and division first. So we have here 2 times 4, then 8 divided by 4. 2 times 4, 8. 8 divided by 4, 2 n equals 8 plus 2, 10. Another, we have 2 plus 5 times 3 
minus 6 equals n. n is equal to multiplication and division first. So we have 5 times 3, 15. Bring down to, so n, 2 plus 15 minus 6. Perform from left to right. n is equals to 2 plus 15, that is 17 minus 6. n is equal to 17 minus 6, that is 11. By this time, we are going to uh, increase the level of difficulties. We are going to use the four fundamental operations. We have here the division, addition, multiplication, and subtraction. So, let's begin. N is equal to multiplication and division first. So, we have the first given here are 4 divided by 2. So, perform this first. 4 divided by 2, that is 2. Next, we have here multiplication 6 times 5. Multiply, that is 30. Okay? Addition sign. Then, subtract the sign, minus 20. N is equal to 2 plus 30, that is 32, minus 20. N is equal to 32 minus 20, that is 12. Way to go, guys. This time again, I have increased the level of difficulty. So as you can see, you can... Uh, we can find five operations here the addition, subtraction, we have two multiplications, and one division. So the start 7 plus 3 minus 5 times 4 divided by 2 times 1 equals n. So n is equal to perform first multiplication or division as they appear from left to right okay left to right multiplication and division from left to right 5 times 4 comes first so we have to solve this first 20 one at a time remember one at a time so n is equal to 7 plus 3 minus 20 that is the answer of 5 times 4 divided by 2 times 1 equals n so n is equals to solve this first 20 divided by 2 10 so 7 plus 3 minus 10 times 1 so n is equal to solve 7 plus 3 minus 10 times 1 that is 10 now we have done solving the multiplication and division. This time, we can solve addition and subtraction as they appear from left to right. So, 7 plus 3, 10, minus 10, and n equals 0. I know some of you guys will ask, what if there are parentheses? bracket or exponents okay so this topic here will be discussed so our next video so the challenge is solve this equation 20 minus 8 plus 3 minus 2 times 4 divided by 2 times 3 Plus n. Okay? Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos. Friendly TV is a YouTube channel that features basic math. We will help you learn lessons in math to the best of our abilities. This channel also features current events, sports, entertainment, cooking food, news and views, Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. See you in the next video.